Normally the solar panels are delivered in boxes and they have to be taken out carefully. It is also recommended to check if the boxes aren't damaged. On the back side of the panel there are two cables coming out. One of them is a positive connection cable and the other is a negative one. You also have a marker on the back which shows you maximum voltage current and power of the solar panel when it's delivered. When you start putting up the solar panels, you have to move them above the ground, because if they are too close to the ground, animals may step on the panels and damage it or even destroy it. Here in this case we see that some of the corners posts of the stand are sticking up above the panel, which means that they will throw some shadows. The shadows of the construction posts will reduce the water output considerably in the morning and the evenings. The positioning of the solar panels is therefore very critical. It should be shadow free the whole day. The panels also shouldn't have dust or dirt on it. That means that you have to clean the panel if dust or dirt settles on the panel over time. Dirt or dust reduces the efficiency considerably and are therefore unwanted. When connecting the solar panels, you can use the provided extension cables up to several meters if the panels aren't close enough to the pump itself. The extension cables will always connect in the correct order because the plugs are arranged in a way that wrong connections aren't possible. Here we can see the connections of the pump itself. In this example, here there is a switch mounted in the connection of the overflow switch, allowing starting and stopping the pump. Generally, in solar mode, after 15 seconds the pump starts operating by itself, or if you press the mode button. It is also possible, if there are some doubts about the quality about the solar panels, to check if the open circuit voltage and the short circuit current in relationship to the solar eye insulation is correct or not. This requires a standard digital multimeter and should be carried out by trained professionals.